So guys, I just wanted to, I just wanted to tell you the story about this socks. Um, you know what happened, guys? I was, um, I was about to leave the the house where I stayed this night after the priest, you know, uh, offered me this apartment to stay for free, and uh, I realized my socks weren't dry enough. So uh, I was very intelligent. I was thinking maybe I could put them in the oven so that they could dry quicker. But they, uh, I left them there and I found them in fire. Beautiful. Uh, I couldn't find the second pair of socks that I had. And so what I, I, I was asking here in this, in this, uh, in this town, you know. If there is someone that mm, sells you socks like this, and uh, a woman um, went in her house and took this brand new socks from you guys for free. This is why I like um, the small towns, guys. This profile. So this town is called Gerano. Gerano. And, um, you know, this was something I, I, I hugged her and um, it was a beautiful moment. That's why I want to live in this in such place, because people are more human. In big cities, people are monsters, unfortunately. You know, everything looked fine, guys, you know. It was summer and all of a sudden, uh, it's like 20-something, very uh, late uh, May. And the elite have the power to change from summer to winter in just a few seconds. So sorry for being like the dumbest around me, guys, with the mask, but but this is because it's really cold right now and it's raining like crazy. I started to record now because it was impossible even to record. Even though I had the roof, the the wind the wind was flowing this way and I had hail. Hail that now is is of course gone because it's not like uh, winter winter but it was you know entering here here was the only spot that rain could not enter look only there so it's uh, I was almost planning to put the tarp here you know but this uh, zombies you know would uh, look at you crazy who is this guy what is he doing I will call the police you know so here's the situation guys all of a sudden we find ourselves in uh, winter and this is uh, what you can do when you have lots of dummies at your disposal to use however you want, just by paying them. And I have a confirmation now, guys, that because more and more people are talking about uh, how these people are controlling us uh, mentally. And so I suggest you to, uh, to watch uh, a documentary uh, maybe I will put in the description a link of a, of a great video that I, I just listened now. And, uh, you know, since I've always had this suspicion because the people around me are, are incredibly dumb guys. And, it, and it's in incredible because I used to hang out with people and we were at the same length, you know. All of a sudden, I don't know exactly where it happened, but I started to lose all of my friends everybody even at my home and everything and it is impossible guys it's impossible and i always had the suspicion that they are controlled mentally and somehow they are leaving some of us uh, to, to check what we will do as a controlled uh, you know in, a, in an experiment you know the, you you leave some without the uh, effect of uh, what you are trying to to do you know to see the difference you know because it's impossible, and now uh, we are seeing, we are seeing, and uh, and it's creepy, guys. It's creepy. The level level of control they have on us is unbelievable. Right now, I I heard uh, uh, a lightning, which which had like a metallic sound, very very weird. I don't know. I don't. Uh, I can expect whatever from this monster, guys. So. Hopefully, hopefully the rain will stop. Uh, I hope, you know, I don't know what intention have this moment, you know. 
good thing is that you know the Italian flag over there it, it's not visible anymore so that's a good thing that the rain did you know but again guys well for me it's not it's not a problem I can sleep even here you know I could put the BB here and I could like pretend I'm sleeping <laughs> for all night you know <laughs> because it's impossible to sleep like, like that you know so this uh, these places guys are completely desert nobody lives here because they have been all uh, here is a mountain guys so Italy was full of cities like this where people lived they moved them all in the big cities so that they can control them better and use them better okay people should not be independent with their land you know be able to you know with the sheep and with the with the land you know you can grow your own stuff and be independent no they don't want that so in this town called whatever you know Rocca whatever Rocca, Rocca Canteralis it's here <laughs> look my zoo how, how beautiful is my zoo you can you know, pretend you read it okay so this is what they did guys I removed all people from here and with the virus now they have the they, now they have the perfect excuse so even though I can take a room here and leave even with the grass here I, I would survive even with the grass here yeah but they will won't let you because they would say to you look you have virus you are infecting yourself come out of that room and come with me in this in the dumb cities so just quickly guy on uh, an update this is a, a bus stop that uh, unfortunately doesn't pass anymore the last bus that passed uh, has already passed and so it looks like uh, I'm gonna sleep under this thing here in the bus stop. Uh, it's amazing! It's amazing how evil a priest can be, guys. So I just passed two towns here, guys. On on one there was no priest, so I go. I went to the other one, which is this one here. This town here. Well, you can see it because there is some whatever uh, uh, drops on the lens whatever so this priest guys it's I told him you know my situation and everything he turned everything I said to him guys into something that I was like a threat to him because he he uh, it's like he understood you know these people here guys have a church huge church that stays closed all the night guys although it's creepy and i've never slept in uh, inside the church and i would not uh, not want to but in a case like this you know when it's when it's cold as i said it's like winter here uh, now guys and um, and it's raining non-stop this monster uh called this priest monster called another priest superior telling me look there is an albanian here that he he he, he says that uh, you know while talking to him I, I said to him you know that uh, you know, I don't believe in this virus BS you know I mean who will I uh, contaminate if I sleep alone there you know and he he's Albanian and he doesn't believe in the virus and is and I I, I must I, I was almost feeling that he he was this close you know to call the police guys this this man was evil so I just I, I told him clearly man if you don't have a place where uh, to give me no problem I'll, I'll go away so I was staying you know I was staying to, to see what what she, she he could do you know and he called the superior and started to tell to tell him all this stuff at that point I, I just you know uh, said kind of I, I don't know how to say in English like fight fuck you monster well what are you doing I told him man I just asked you a place where to sleep and I, I didn't you you are almost treating me as, as I was a, a terrorist you know unbelievable guys so just in a, in, in one day you know uh, the, the the contrast is, is amazing it, it all depends you know this priest by the way guys it was from Nigeria from Nigeria this monster total zombies guys total monsters 
It's not their place, these guys. These people are chosen by the church because they are soldiers, obeying soldiers, poor people come that came from Africa and do not care. They are obeying. And, and in fact, I told him, yes, I know that you have orders to not let anyone sleep in your church during the night. Even though there are people suffering, guys, these are monsters. Italy is full of churches that can very well, you know, uh, let people sleep there instead of sleeping like this under the cold. In Rome is full of churches and people sleep in the street, guys. These are monsters, guys, that will pay soon. Monsters from God, no, not from man. Man is asleep. And so this guy, man, unbelievable. Unbelievable monster, man. And, and while I was going, you know, I said to him, oh, man, God is watching you, you monster. You monster. So that's it, guys. Let me stop this because I don't have, not even battery. So, well, maybe, guys, I don't know uh, in what condition I will be tomorrow because tomorrow also they say it will rain. I don't know. Maybe I will stop all this here. Who knows? See you.